Hello and welcome to the Romance Seminar. I'm your host Jay Green. I haven't talked to you in a while, so Happy New Year. Um, I want to go into the Responsibility um, 200 series. Um, I came to a realization, I was talking to an old, old, old friend of mine, 10 years, and uh, we were discussing how people really want to give up their will, free will. And I wanted to kind of examine free will today and talk about how people kind of perceive that. You know, free will is li literally a will of your life. And religiously, people want to give up that will. Some people give it up to God, some people give it up to the devil, but it's the will over the, the actual responsibility over your life. You're responsible for your own successes daily. You're responsible for your, your journey through life and where you end up. It's your fault if you do well and it's your success. No one's going to congratulate you if you succeed. And I just want to go through and give some examples of how people miss out on how good their life could be if they only take responsibility for the long-term effects. If you decide not to graduate from school, that affects the rest of your life. If you decide uh, to go back to school, that affects the rest of your life. If you decide to have sex without protection, that affects the rest of your life. If you decide to go get medication, that affects the rest of your life. If you decide to get AIDS tests, that affects the rest of your life. That it, again, everything you do affects the rest of your life. So I can understand how people feel when they're like, you know, they want to give their life to God, but you got to understand you're giving it, but at the same time, you still have to do something in the meantime. You've given your life, but then all the works that you do in your life are contributes or tributes to God. So you don't just sit on your sofa and say, hey, I gave my life to God, I'm good. I don't have to do anything else for the rest of my life. And and I really want to examine how people look at that. It's, 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 very, it's very intriguing to find that people are, I mean, I really understand how people are codependent. They don't want to be responsible for their failures. They don't want to be responsible if it doesn't work out. They don't want to be responsible for their lives. So they rather give the will of their life to someone else. So examine yourself. Do you really take advantage that everything you do is because of you? Everything you do is a affects other people. Some people are so codependent that you can't live your life without living theirs or without without their life impacting your life. So examine who your life is impacting. 